Does everybody have a copy of your dream? Okay, we'll start with yours first then. Then Belinda. Okay. Then. I think this is your dream. Yeah. Okay. Okay, who needs more time to read it? Okay.
Okay, who needs more time? A couple of times? Okay. That's it? Yes? Fair enough? Yeah. Okay, look. Principle. When a dream has one theme that runs through many scenes, right? it's there for a purpose. It's taking the problem and turning it around through all its parameters, all the ways it may express itself, and in each scene that will be dealing with a specific aspect of the problem in a unique way. So therefore, when you go over a dream that has this, this quality, then you want to see whether or not the basic theme or problem throughout the whole dream has been resolved, whether it's a success or a failure. Ah, then, hey, if it's a failure especially, you want to then look over these scenes and see which one to focus on in order to open up the nature of the problem. Mm. Or you can take any one of them, but better to take a look at them all. Mm. all right, so what would you say is the basic theme running through the whole, pro the whole dream? Don? Not getting along with this one person. Yeah, yeah. how would you put it? Yeah, and uh, never understanding. It seems like he doesn't understand why. Right, good, good. He's, un he's unsure about even if, who this guy is. Okay. I, I can't add to what they're saying. Same? Yeah, along the same what they're saying, along the same line of what they're saying, that okay. he doesn't know why this person hates him. So even though he's trying to fight, fight him physically, I, I don't think that's the problem, the real problem of solving the, the okay. physical force. You noticed he raised a point and then dropped it and kept talking. <laughs> Do you recall what you, you said and what you dropped even though you introduced it? About the... I, I, Kind of but it was the guy. Oh, I'll let you it over. Hey, uh, Simon, I forgot what you just said. Would you repeat it? Oh, so he, he doesn't like this. The guy doesn't like him, but he's trying to fight, fight him back. 
but he knows that it's not about. Okay. Um, he does he All right. You're forgotten. Okay. Sorry, I lost it. All right. Okay. Harry? What theme would you say runs through the whole? Uh, All right. Okay. Karen? Okay. Fear. 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 Okay. Um, that sense that there's nothing he can do about it. Similar. No. Yeah. No. Virginia. Um, I think that continues until the end, where he comes up with an okay. idea of how he can deal, deal with it, and he still doesn't. He says that he, uh, he d- has the idea. Uh, would you say that there's a fair way to deal with it, so we can see whether he proposes something that might be successful or not? Well, he thinks it will be successful, okay. but okay. Okay. It, he doesn't do it. Okay, it looks like. Well, <clears throat> one question. Um, read uh, the first one. For paragraph one? Yeah. First one, two, yeah. <clears throat> I'm on a football field in practice. This is my first year there. I'm in the first days in this new school. I guess it's college, Dartmouth or something. Go ahead. There's this bigger black guy, another teammate, who hits me from behind for no reason. I turn around and try to tackle him, too, but it doesn't have much effect. I can tell this guy just hates me, and I don't know why. And it's just going to be one of those situations where someone just doesn't like you, and they're going to keep coming after you, and there's nothing you can do about it except fight them or something. In the dream, when you realize, I don't know why, what does that do to you? state of mind. Helpless. Mm -hmm. Um, Of course confused. Mm -hmm. And because of the dream that we explored last time here, I don't think it would so much these days, but apparently the dream is saying so, I don't know, but uh, it, it would go even further than just helpless or confused normally because of the original sin guilt that I normally carry around. I would, I would question myself uh, as a result of this. Is there something that he sees about me that I don't see about myself? So I'm thinking, oh, maybe he's right. Uh, Look at this. Feeling guilty. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Just as you did a moment ago, uh, what state of mind is he in then? <clears throat> in the dream. Can you pick that up? I mean, you interact. What's my assessment of him now, or what's in the dream, what's my assessment of second, him? Second paragraph. And it continues. He sees something about me, and maybe he is right. When that takes place in the dream, what do you notice about his state of mind? Well, uh, it puts him into anger. So he's unbalanced. More, what kind of anger? Come on. Um, anger is a big word. I mean, to add more, a couple Well, of he's, he's, he's furious. It's... Furious. Uh, Although he's not doing it, I mean, he's just, it, it's, it, it, it's the kind of anger that makes a person do things that they really should not, like get violent towards others. So he's, it's almost like he's got to eradicate me. He hates me and everything I stand for. 
And so it's going to be a it's going to be futile on his part, but he's going to try anyway. He's okay. so mad. Anger, furious. You had a nice expression after that. How would you put it? He has to eradicate me. Yeah, I got And that. everything that no. I stand for. No, that's true. But it's going to be futile. No, but is he showing his anger and furiousness? Uh, facially, no. No. Okay. But um, not obvious to someone viewing it, right? Um, You're saying it's not no, in his it, face, or? Well, he's not going through a lot of dramatic things, but it is obvious to everyone around that he's, through his actions of like tackling me no. from behind and stuff, and he obviously hates me. It, it, it would be obvious, um, but not through, no. not necessarily through facial expressions. No, no, good, 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 good. <clears throat> Um, uh, now can you go back to put now that you see him this way can you add the effect it has on you add some more words please well actually I just have to throw in I like what you're doing this is this is almost like a uh, Parmenidean dialectic, right? What are the effects Me? on... Yeah, yeah that? Would you be... <laughs> what are the effects on others and then Go back on us? That's right. Very, very okay. nice. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Um, so what's the effect on me now that I see that in him? Mm -hmm. I'm... Um, well, I thought actually I... I thought I had, is that not what I was saying when I said I don't know why, I'm helpless, I'm confused? Isn't that not what I was describing see, after seeing that in him? I thought it was. Okay. Uh, but I'll, I now can, that you see him in this state, he, right? You're like, why would a person hate me so much? Yeah, but what does it do to you? Uh, it surprises me. Surprise? It, um, You know, it, it's it's interesting because it it ought not to uh, it puts um, instantly a, a kind of guilt or shame on me, even though I have no idea what he's mad about. It's almost like I yes. I, I can't Good. defend myself Good. because he might be right. No. <laughs> um. See, this thing plays itself out then, doesn't it? Maybe he's right. Yeah. Right? That, then that plays a major role that produces this curious thing called guilt and shame on me. He may be right. And that's what immobilizes me. And that immobilizes you. Right. Or at least it makes me hesitate and I can't be completely effective in my response. And this keeps me from being effective. Yeah. However, what do you notice you do as a result? As a result. you look at all of the scenes that follow. Um, I I try a combination of strategies. Um, I do try to fight him several okay, times. Okay, therefore you become like him. Um, Tip for time. It, well, where are you going with that? I'm just saying that I, it looks like that you're whatever. Yes and no. Yeah, well, I am like him physically. I'm taking him on. Okay. But I don't internally have that state yeah, of anger okay. that he does. So. I'm in a different state of mind than yeah. he is. So I do to him what he's doing to what me. What he did to me. That's one of the strategies. Yeah. Yeah. So I become him. Yeah. You're saying. Yeah. All right. In this respect, right? There's yes. another way in which you're not. Of course, internally you're not. Yeah. Okay. 
So look here, we just said half. What, what's that? Half. Half. Gotcha. <laughs> because the other side, they're different. Yeah. Yeah. Because. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I, I'm interested in uh, two questions here. You see, um, it's hopeless, confused. It surprised me. Uh, now that I see him, it, uh, I get this idea, you know, that maybe he's right, and that has an effect on me, yeah. it puts guilt and shame into the game, and this keeps me from being effective. Right? Yep. Yeah, yeah. I'm not familiar with those two words. Could you talk to me guilt about the effect it has on you? Guilt and shame? It really goes back to the same feeling as the dream that we explored a couple I weeks ago. I have a bad it's, memory. It, it isn't specific. It's very non-specific guilt and shame. Like it doesn't go back to any specific event or to any particular. Yeah, it's non-specific. But what does it do to you? Immobilizes you. You said before. Yeah. So what does it do to me? Um, Uh, the shame does what? What does that do? It, it feels like a. It feels like a bowl, a cavity in my chest that's just unfillable. Um, like some like a vacuum that just went in, and um, nothing can repair it, nothing can fill it. Um, it's just a, a void of um, of wrong. And, and that has an effect. Yeah. Which is? Yeah. Which, which, which is what? Well, the effect is I, I hesitate. I can't respond in yeah. a uh, just uh, temperate thinking courageous, no. kind, no. understanding no. way, and no. my, my brain shuts down, all those things. Yeah, yeah, can't respond, no rational responses available to me, right? Yeah. That's right, that's what it does. Mm. Yeah, that's what that stuff does, yeah, yeah. Um, you're pretty close to that state right now, aren't you, in reflection on it? I'm pretty in touch with it, yep. Yeah, where does it come from? From your past and your early days? Where does it come from? What comes to your mind? Why do we always go back to that silly doghouse scene? Hey, no, no. <laughs> Anything you go back to, there's something you haven't yeah. seen about it. So just try. If that comes up, we deal with it. Go ahead. What happened? So, I, I forgot it, by the way. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm sure. So I'm in the doghouse with uh, my two female friends, and I'm a uh, really young tyke. I'm guessing two or something. And they want me to take my underwear down or my diapers or whatever I am. And uh, my mom walks past, and they're sort of giggling. And uh, my mom walks past out in the yard, maybe 30 yards off. And it's unclear to me whether she sees me or she sees me and looks really quickly, turns her head, and then turns away and keeps going, I think. And leaves me in a puzzled state. Uh, it leaves me with a lot of questions. That, that much we've explored before. I, yeah. I know that it gives yeah. me tons like of puzzles that. at that yeah. point. Yeah. Yeah. So, um, why do you think it, uh, we have given this case? Why, just look at it impartially for a moment. Why right. is there a problem here? Why does it do all of this? And why does it persist? Uh, like, what's doing that? So let me ask it another way. Mm. Um, Right now, if you could have turned to her right now, 
Yeah. What would you wa ideally want to say to get rid of that puzzle? Directly, right now. Right, 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 right. Well, I don't think these are going to hit the mark, but the first thing that comes to mind is, what the hell, am I chopped liver over here? Or what are you doing? More. Um, but to get more specific... No, no, that's good if you tell me what that means. Um, why aren't you doing anything about this situation? More. Um... Uh, because you, you know why you, have, you need more? Because you haven't addressed the problem. <laughs> Go ahead, try it again. Um, have I not addressed... You have to keep the puzzle in your mind in that scene and only answer that. What should you have said, ideally? Go ahead. Um, Where's your courage? Yeah, okay. I'll write that down because it's important. <laughs> yeah, okay. Um, okay. Um. What do you want to know? Oh, um, am I bad or good? Not bad, not good. Closer. Closer. Um... Would you not agree the key moment is when she turns away? At that moment, what yeah. would you want to say? What would I want to say at that point? Yeah. Why are you abandoning me? That's meant the better, better, but you're not dealing with the fact that she turned away. Um, are you? What do you see that you can't deal with? Better? What? What do you see that you can't deal with? Oh. And what is it that she can't deal with, that she saw? Yeah, this question we haven't handled in previous Go talks ahead. about this scene. Come on. This seems to get straight to the issue. Go, well, I, I don't know the... Go ahead. Well, I don't know either, but... Yeah, go ahead. Go ahead. It's, it's go going ahead. there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, Um, I don't know, she can't deal with, with, um, the joy and the curiosity and the, mm -hmm. everything in very young kids, including her own son, having to do with sex or learning about body parts and all that she can't deal with. Oh, so then what do you want to ask her? How come what? Um... Oh, but see, okay, here's the puzzle for me. Okay. Maybe she can deal with it, and she's, and, and her turning her head and continuing on is her way of, of saying, I'm going to leave you guys to have your privacy, and, and she is okay with it. <laughs> nope, not when this is present. I see. Well, wait, then we have to be able to... If that's present, guilt and shame, Well, I learned that, but why does that mean that's what she wanted to teach? I didn't, I didn't suggest that is what she wanted to teach. I said, that's the state of mind you're left with. <coughs> yeah. Yeah. So. But why does that indicate that she's not okay with the scene? Well, we're not dealing with the issue. What should you have said at that moment? By the way, 
What we are now dealing with the question of what did she see in you? What state of mind did she see you in? So oh, go ahead. now we're getting down to it, baby. <laughs> go ahead. Now we're hitting the mark. Swing. No, come on. Um. <laughs> I uh, I enjoyed the attention. I, I did have a puzzle. I mean, these were my friends, my these, this girl and her sister. I uh, So I wasn't quite sure if they're laughing at me or with me, but I mostly felt they were laughing with me. Mm-hmm. Um, and, I, and I liked being the focus of the attention. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Uh, how would you describe your... Come on, she's seeing you in a certain state of mind. Yes. Now you're telling Why me about your friends, but not it? her. Come on. It's always the same, isn't it? State of mind. Yeah. They catch you in that state. Oh. You could be painting a wall, you could be driving a race car, it doesn't matter, does it? Doesn't matter. That's right. Wow. We don't allow this in Irish Catholic culture. <laughs> That's the wrong accent, but yeah, we don't what know What did she say? Come on. What did she say that she had to turn away from? Um, bliss. Because you were in what kind of state of mind? In, uh, in a blissful state. Blissful? Yeah. Fun? Fun. Open? Open. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, more words? Uh, well, there's an additional component to it, which is that I wasn't just blissful, open, and fun, and all of that, but I was in that state with someone. Yes, yes, yes. So I was sharing that state with yeah. someone. Yeah, yeah, so she also saw we can't do that. sharing it. Right, we can't do that in my family. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> so, wow. here's the question. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you tell me all the times in your life when you may have been in that state, and she saw it, what did she do in each one of those times? You know, last time we also talked about the little Ziploc bag of pot she found on the dryer, mm-hmm. right? It's the same thing. Yeah, what does that tell you? That bag of pot represents a state of bliss somebody wants to get yeah. into. Yeah. We're not going to talk about it, we're just going to yeah. leave you with a puzzle, so feel guilty about it. Said, we are not going to talk about it. Yep. Uh, what does that mean? Inquire? Come on. Uh, what does that mean? Talking about Isn't it. Isn't it so powerful not talking about something? No. Yeah. 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 But come on. We're not going to talk about it. Yeah. All right? That means you're not going to what? Put it in other language. Are you going to inquire about it, or what, what does this no. mean? No. Huh? No, the, the contract is I don't inquire about it. That's the, that's the deal. Thank you. It's a, it's, a, it's a contract, yeah. That would make her very uncomfortable. It would make her, come on. It would make her very, very uncomfortable. Who yeah. are you saving? Her. Thank you. Okay, what did you learn? Hmm. I don't inquire. I don't challenge, cha- right? I don't make the other person uncomfortable. Challenge. Don't challenge right. them. Especially when it's about uh, their discomfort with, with a high state of mind I'm in. Therefore, sharing it with others. What did your friend in that, that black trap, yeah. what did he see in you at that moment? Oh. That requires me to go back to the very beginning yes, of yes, the dream. Yes, yes. And what are you not, not, hey, from this you learn something, right? I was probably in a state of excellence. Yeah, yeah. The same state, you know, bliss. And therefore joy, you yeah. couldn't, what, at this point? Uh, I, uh, wait, 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 wait. What's the question here? I, therefore, I couldn't... What would you have ideally liked to ask the black child? Um, answer the koan. Yeah, which is? 
Um, um, well, I always like to answer these if I can in a way which um, uses the very. Th I'm trying to figure it out. That uses the very thing that he's objecting to, in a way which invites him in. So, it's, so it, it dissolves the uh, the animosity at the same time as it. Right? Mm -hmm. So I might say something like, uh, uh, "Hey, man, you can do it too. Let me show you how to do this. Let's let's practice it together, or something like that." You're not dealing with it. Same thing. You're not dealing with him. You're not dealing with him. You're not dealing with her. You're not dealing with his anger at the right. state of excellence. <laughs> Bless you. How do you? Well, that's it. Okay, so that's the, that's all these together. That's the koan for them all. How do you deal if if the issue is with any given pathologos, regardless of the yeah. face that it takes? How do you deal with anybody's discomfort in your own excellence in any in any context? How do you deal with that? Hey, you can answer that. Ideally, what should you have done with that and that scene in the first two sections? Okay, well. First of all, from the, if we can learn from this, come on. Well, first and foremost, you have to stay in that state yourself. Yeah. You, you, you can't let them pull you out of it. Yeah, go ahead. And so any response you make has to come out of the same state yeah. of excellence. Yeah. Well, what is that? What would that be? Um, I don't know. That was a good hit, buddy. Try it again. Let's do it. Or something like that. I don't know. But that's, I'm not dealing with his... That's, no, no. That's half true. That's half true. But you're not asking... Yeah, like why? That's right. So I have to say something to him like... Uh, but see, in one of the scenes I did, like, what's your problem? And he answers, it's your smell. Hey. What? Is when you ask him what is his problem, that is not as... Come on. That means you'd have to know that language. Uh, um, Make it simple. What would you have to ask him? What problem do you have with my playing football so well? Okay. Is that... Um, that's, that's what problem do you down. have with... That's very close. Come I'm, on. I'm having fun here. What's, what's, what, what's, what's the problem that you're having with my having fun? No, oh, that's better. See, that goes here too, see? Right. Yep. Same problem. Both of them. Right. Yeah, you've told us all in the past that um, whenever anybody has a problem with someone else, there are actually two problems. There's the one they claim and then there's the real one, right? Sure. So what you're saying is uh, I need to forget the smell and the football and all that stuff and just focus on he doesn't like this state of, of uh, excellence. And therefore you're going to ask him? And you have to focus on. on that issue in him. What it, Do it. Um, what, you don't like having fun? No, it's okay. <laughs> I think I'm up to like number six now. Um, guessing. So that's half right, but well, you're seeing him acting with a certain hostility against you. Right. Can you put that into words? Uh, why do you get so angry when you see that I'm just having fun? That deals with them both, doesn't it? Yes, it's both aspects of it. What if you could ask that same question here with your mother? Um. Why do you get afraid and turn your head away when you see that I'm having fun? Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. That's it. That's it. That's it. Very nice. Hi. <laughs> Oh, I should let you do it. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. That's all right. Doesn't matter. There it is. Thank you. Thank you. Sure. <laughs> okay. This is Belinda's. Sure. Yeah,
In every dream, there's a theme, mm -hmm. and it has a turning about, or a pivot, or a turning about as a change in mind. That's the key to look for, right? You want to look for where the change occurs, and follow it up the implications of it, and how that affects what came before it, right? That's analysis, right? So as you look at the dream, is there one theme throughout the whole? You would say? No, I'm just learning. <laughs> okay. All right. Is there one theme that runs through the whole? Yeah. Pardon? Yes. Yes. Okay, if that's the case. Okay? Is there a turning about? Something in the dream that changes direction yeah. or brings about a different change of mind? Mm -hmm. Can you put your finger on it? Yeah. If so, is that where you would start to your inquiry? Mm -hmm. right. Okay. I see it in the second dream. Okay. Mm. <coughs> Pardon me, are those two dreams? Yes, they're two dreams. Okay, I'm doing the second dream first. Okay. Oh, no. Okay. I realize this is not the way I want to go. I try to turn out of the turn I was going in, trying to circle out and go and not go into the parking lot. I notice that many people are walking towards this building in front of me. So I have to be careful not to run them over. So I slowly drive and stop when I see someone close and try to drive again um, and to leave. Okay, yeah. um,
Could have read that. So. So I realize this is not the way I want to go. Stop. Read. Okay. You're in the dream. Mm -hmm. Right. Mm -hmm. What does that refer to in the dream? I don't want to go into this no. parking lot. As a result of something that you saw. Mm -hmm. Is that right? Yes. Look here. Here you are. Okay. What did you see? I saw that the parking lot was associated with the building because they both had lime green um, banners. God, what did that do to you? It made me realize that there's this association between the two. Between the, that and the building. In that and the building. Right, and the yes. people. Yes, the people. Yes, because the people are going to this building. Yeah, yeah, yes. yeah, yeah, yeah. That's an interesting perception, isn't it? Like you saw something interesting that these are not related. The parking lot and the building and well, the people. Well, the lime, lime green flags, and that's what you said. Mm -hmm. And the people gathering around that building, right? Yes. Yes. Right. Right. So you're seeing two things, and they don't fit for you, is that correct? So therefore you're saying the consequence of that is? I, I knew I didn't belong there. I knew I didn't belong there. Yeah. And that was a good time then to... to get out of it. Yeah, 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 yeah. What's that like? That scene, what's that like? Um, it's like knowing where I belong and where I don't belong. Yeah, yeah. No, um, these are, uh, uh, flags, are they not? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Line, right? Mm -hmm. Line, green, flags. Mm -hmm. Um, uh, uh, what comes to your mind when you reflect on that? What I found interesting about this building and about this parking lot and these flags or these the, the banners, whatever you want to call them, is that there was no distinguishing what they this building even was or what this parking lot even was and how they were associated. Yeah, yeah. Only the only reason I associated them was because these this had green and the building had green, yeah. lime green. Yeah. That's the only way that's the only thing I knew is why they were associated. Yeah. Uh, just one more. You see, in the dream, um, um, the third line mm. might pick it up from the second. But uh, the where I turn? Yeah. I turned to try to go out of the turn I was going in, trying to circle out as to not go into the parking lot. I noticed many people walking towards the building in front of me. So I have to be careful not to run them over. Uh -huh. I keep driving. Mm -hmm. Then I see across the street mm -hmm. has also changed. Oh yeah, there's a lot of change. There is a building with a Lime, lime, green banner mm -hmm. with no name on it. What yes. does that do to you? Come on, at, at that moment in the, the dream. That's just my curiosity kept um, peaking because at first I noticed that there was many stores. And these stores didn't have any names on them. They seemed empty. They seemed like they were abandoned stores. 
But people were, were, were standing outside of them like they were waiting for them to open. So that didn't make sense to me. And then the, my curiosity even more peaked when I saw this building. Yeah. Yeah. And this also didn't have a name on it. Yeah. You wouldn't even know it was open. Right. You wouldn't even know people would go yeah. there. Yeah. Yeah. And But I knew I wasn't supposed to be there. So at that moment, you say, there's no name on it. What did that do to you? Hey, it's got no name on it. What did it come in the dream? Um, I was like, like, um, it's like I wanted to know why, but it, but it seemed like, um, like I, like people were seeing something I wasn't, or I was seeing something they weren't. Uh, well, that was an interesting state, right? Mm -hmm. What does that do to you? Um, what does that do? It makes me wonder what, why I'm seeing things different than others. Um, like, why is my seeing um, not the way others are seeing? It's like I almost feel like I'm seeing things for what they are, and people are not seeing things for what they are, or vice versa. Yeah, 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 yeah. I am seeing what is, they are not. Mm-hmm. Right? That's how it feels. Pardon? That's how it feels. That's how I, I interpreted it. Yeah. What is that, teacher? I want to, I want to know why. Why, why they, why they can't see. And why is my seeing different? What makes my seeing different? Yeah, yeah. They're very interesting questions, aren't they? What? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, what does it do to them? What does it do? <laughs> this is what's been going on with me my whole life. Yeah, yeah. Um, it, yeah, they, this has a long history, right? Yeah, yeah. It's been with you for many, many years. It does something to you. Yeah, it makes me almost feel alien. What, what? It makes me feel alien. Um, I'm not familiar with that term. What's <laughs> like that I'm like? not from this planet. What, what? Like I'm not from this planet. <laughs> mm. More. Um, that I got dropped here on my head um, by some other beings or species. Yeah, maybe it's maybe <laughs> maybe it had an accident. That's why. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. You're in that state now, aren't you? Right. This brought up that state in you. Well, I think the, this yeah. this dream brought it up in me. The That's first okay. one. Yeah. Uh, give me an early memory of that. You're, you're now in it, so... Come on, how far back does it go? Young, very young. How? Very young. Four? Three? <laughs> as long as I can remember okay. thinking, having mind. Yeah, 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 yeah. One was quick, quick, quick in me numbers. Um, uh, four, three, two. Four, five, something like yeah, that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah? Uh, when was it? Can you recall? Um, there I was. It's like I felt like um, I could see things that... Uh, 
that others were not seeing. What did it do to you? Um, but this it made me feel like I was uh, not a part of, of no, what true, was going see? on. But what is it you were seeing that they weren't seeing at that age? It must have been something like, wow. What was, can you recall? Um, beauty. So I'll take that. What was it? When? There you were. And you had an experience of beauty. Profound beauty. A profound beauty, right. Deeply moving? Yes. Yeah, yeah. Um, I, um, I, I saw, um, people suffering and in pain and hurt and, uh, unhappy and, um, all around. Yes. And, I didn't understand why they were like this when yeah, this yeah. is all around. Yeah, that's right. If I'm here, why are they there? And everything that goes along with it. Yeah, hey, I got a. Um, um, while I'm wondering about it, I wanted you to tell me an answer to that. Why they're yeah, here? Yeah, yeah, go ahead. <laughs> go ahead. They don't it. see? Yeah, yeah, go ahead. They don't see. What? They don't see. Yeah. They, uh, they don't see what I see. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, why do they suffer? They don't see the beauty. Okay. You see, what kind of a state of mind were you in before you had that experience of profound beauty? Wonderment. Hmm? Wonderment. I was in a state of wonder. Right. And that built, didn't it? And this then developed. So now can you answer the question in a new way? Can you repeat the question, please? What was the question? Is it that they can't see profound beauty or they can't... Wonder about it? Is this what, was this the preceding state before you got into this? Yes. Therefore, what is their problem? They don't wonder. They don't look. They don't even ponder to wonder. No. No. Hmm. Okay. What do you mean, okay? <laughs> Come on, tell me. Come on. Let's... Then you were open to what? Yeah. Wonder. And the, that brought you into yeah. all this, right? Mm -hmm. But mm -hmm. most people finish it. They don't even wonder. They don't wonder. Well, does that make you an alien? Sometimes I feel that way. <laughs> Come on. No. What no. does it make you? Someone who can see, uh, experience things because they're in wonderment. Yeah. That's why they call you wonderful. <laughs> or Wonder Woman. <laughs> right? You think I'm crazy. <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe they're the alien. <laughs> well, let's put this aside. Let's look at the first string. Oh, yeah, this one's fun. Okay. Now, Add any features to it you want. Same question here as we had before. What's the issue? Where does it turn about? Come on. Oh, I have to admit that I went to bed with many questions on my mind when I had this dream. That's okay. That's all right. Give okay. people a chance. We're on the first one now. Okay. I'm determining between two, three, four, and five. Seeing if... if there is one or self in them. 
Seeing what holds them together. Were there any images in the dream, or was this sub-vocal or vocal, or Um, how did it come to you? How were you present? Were you present? It was almost like my other dreams where I'm, it's almost like I feel like there's this this puzzle box in front of me, Uh and I'm moving around words, Mm -hmm. things. and I'm putting them in their proper place, I would say, like that. I have this dream, I have the same sort of feeling mm-hmm. like mm-hmm. a lot of dreams I have. Like, um, like yeah, like it's a puzzle that I'm trying to put together in my mind. Okay, so what do I want to do? La, 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 la. Okay. Same question as before. Come on, take a look. Where do you want me to go? Uh, yeah, just for a moment. Everybody need any more time? Okay, we go. I presume it's okay to go, right, sir? Okay, please read it. Okay. I'm determining between two, three, four, and five, seeing if there is one or self in them, seeing what holds them together, seeing what commonness they have, must have, to keep themselves together and not dissolve. Once I start doing this, it's plain to see how one can jump from five to four to three to two. That once one sees one is one, all the other hypotheses fall, fade away. And one is all that's left. Even two is not one. How can it be? For two is part of one, but not the one itself. For two comes from one. Even in the beauty of the two, there is no one. For the one is even beyond the beauty of the second. Beyond logos, virtue, even the good. There is something beyond all the ideals, something that even the Logos can't express, because the One is beyond Logos, for all things come from the One. It's the source of all the things that Logos can express. But these things are not the One itself, but that which come from the One. Using any word to express the One is like a placeholder, but not the One itself. Putting any word on the one is like trying to capture it. And every time one does this, the reality of one, what one is trying to do is like swiping invisible flies. Okay. Look for the pivot. Where's the pivot? Where's the shift? Is there a thing? What's the thing? What happens to the thing? Hmm. Is it blocked? Is it developed? What causes the shift if there's a shift? All good questions.
Good question. Good question. Okay. What would you say is the thing? How did you spot it? What evidence do you have that it exists in the dream? Does it continue? Does it shift? If it shifts, where did it shift? What did it shift to? What are the implications of that in terms of the dream? Right, just normal questions. <laughs> I feel um, I, 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 I'm feeling like I did on the last one, which was like um, I hesitated to share because I felt like I was overreading it. But I'm going to just get brave and just tell you I'm probably way putting way more meaning into this than there really is. But to me, this feels like it's about relationships and love and God and for instance you were talking about the two is with the one but it doesn't it isn't the whole one mm-hmm. um, and also like us with with one um, and you can't capture it it's just too big and mm-hmm. wonderful mm-hmm. Um, and you can't you know it's like swiping at flies because you can't capture it it's not capturable but it's okay. huge and I'm probably over, way over. Oh, please, I'll knock it. You don't have to knock it. I'll make fun of it. But it's beautiful, actually. No, okay, look here. That's the drama. That's not the thing. What's mm. the difference between the drama and the thing? All right, let me change the word theme. Maybe you can shift it. Um, Relationship. Hmm. Function. Oh. <coughs> Meaning. Functioning. Hmm. What is functioning in the dream? Does it continue throughout the dream? Does it shift? Oh. That's a thing. So mm-hmm. we're putting other words on the idea of thing. Mm. Well, there's a. Uh in the beginning, I'm determining between two and three, and then she's seeing something, and there's several things that she sees, several statements she, she makes about seeing, and then it shifts. Then she starts, once I start doing this, so it's no longer seeing at that point the way she talks mm. about it. What is it, what is it though? Like she's doing something then. Once I start doing it. She's not doing thing, anything. Take a look at that. I'm staying on the word doing. Doing this, it's plain. Okay. It's plain. I'm trying to help you. Plain. So, <coughs> you say what she's doing, that suggests an activity that right. may not be going on with that word in the dream. Okay, well, first of all, then, hey, oh. would you agree the idea of seeing plays a major role yes. in the first part? Mm-hmm. Yes. How many times do you see it? Seeing? Once. Directly and indirectly. Twice. Count. Okay, read Three, it each time, holler. Thank four, you. Four. At least. Five. Ah. Six. Ah. <laughs> a lot. Mm-hmm. Okay. It's all over the place. <laughs> That's all. No, no, it's not all over the place. Oh, okay. Where does it stop? Mm, where does it stop? Okay. And what would you call what's going on after it stops? Mm. Okay, read it again on these times. Every time you're counting, holler. One, two, three, go ahead. Okay, I'm determining between two, three, and five, seeing one, if there is one or self in them. Seeing two, what holds them together. Seeing three, what commonness they must have to keep themselves together and not dissolve. Uh, Once I start doing this, it's plain to see. How one can jump from five to four to three to two. Once one sees this, one is in one, all the other hypotheses fade away. That's another, you could even maybe you say that's another same. one for that. But yeah. Would you agree that's what's functioning in the dream? Yeah. 
Yes. Okay. <coughs> and from that scene, she makes a whole bunch of statements. Agree? Yes. Okay. So you could line them up, could you not? Hmm. <coughs> That's okay. interesting. There's five. Then what would you call what? What takes place after the scene stops? What do you want to call that activity? How is it functioning? It's an activity. It's an activity. Interesting. Understanding? Uh, determining what I'm seeing. <clears throat> Pardon? Determining what I'm seeing. Making uh, judgments. Fine. Reasoning. Maybe. Yeah, reasoning, what I'm seeing. Good. Yeah. Okay, pick it up from Eden and the beauty. Go ahead. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Oh, oh I know. Okay. Is even beyond the beauty of the second. Oh, even even in the beauty of the second, there is no one. For the one is even beyond the beauty of the second. There? Go ahead. Okay. Beyond Logos virtue, even the good. There's something beyond the ideals. Something that even the Logos can't express. Because the one is even beyond Logos. For all things come from the one. It's the source of all the things that Logos can express. But these things are not the one itself, but that which comes from the one. Using any word to express the one is like a placeholder, but not the one itself. Okay. Putting any word on it, on the, one, on. on the one, is like trying to capture it. And every time one does this, the reality of what one is trying to do is like swiping at invisible flies. Okay. What do you want to call this kind of activity? Is it same? Stage two of the Oxford in pictures. Mm. That's true. You're not answering the question. Reflecting. Mm. Reflecting. Yes. I'll take it. And trying to catch the elusive. Right. right. Hold it. One. Mm -hmm. Reflecting. Okay. There's a reflecting, right? Mm -hmm. There's a kind of dis inner discourse. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yep. Would you agree we can cite how many points are being made, yes or no? Yes. Yes. In your discourse? Huh? Yes or no? Okay. Yes, yes. In the same way, could we not then, after we write each one of these, or each one of the points, mm -hmm. and next to it we could spell it out, could we not? Yes. Okay. There are two ways, two ways of functioning. Agree? Oh yeah. Okay. Are they consistent? Hmm. Do they support one another? Hmm. Are there variants? Make hmm. a judgment. Hmm, that's a good question. Hold it. Oh. Huh. Are these consistent? That applies to both. I'm green. <laughs> what? <laughs> well, what are you saying? <laughs> I'm just writing on the board. With it. You used lime green. What? You used lime green. That's true. I noticed that. <laughs> 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 but no, and no, word, no, logos. no logos, yes, and no okay, logos. So, yes. come on. 
Judgment. Come on. Judgment. Yes or no? Well, I would change the word not reflecting, but reasoning. Well, but, has... well I, I, I don't think we'll have issue with that. No. Well, because I like it. Hold it. Like... It strikes me that it's, it's like, yeah, Go ahead. that it's like in the Republic where after you see or reach the vision of the sun, then you start reasoning about the uh, months and years, and that seems to be what she's doing. She Pardon shifts me, into a reason. This seems that way? No, she sh she shifts and starts reasoning okay. about her seed. Okay. So therefore, we will want to know. Come on, finish it. Well, she has two states of mind, the states of mind of seeing and then the state of mind of when she's reasoning. Please, go back to the question. Okay. Mm -hmm. Therefore, we want to know if they are consistent. Mm-hmm. Okay, yeah. Go ahead. Are they? Uh, I want to know, too. I think she adds more to the second the, the part. Thing? She adds more. So are they consistent? That's more. It doesn't answer the question. Someone else want to try it? Mm. Well, she leaves out the self. That's what's interesting. But other than that... Please. Uh, just, I have a simple question. Mm. Are these consistent? Oh, I know why you're having trouble. What is these? Okay. <laughs> I don't know. Yes. I'd say they're consistent. I would say yes, they're consistent. Good. Yeah. Okay, I'll give a grade then, I okay? Know. <laughs> oh, no, I get a grade. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it was going to be a bad one, too. <laughs> now, certainly, you'd want to know why, wouldn't you? Yes, of course. Being so audacious to do that, right? <laughs> What's your opinion? A? No. What? Um, I don't, I don't know what the second five are up there. Pardon me. You should be able to go from the word even, right? Remember where we started? Even in the beauty of two? Yeah. yeah. How many points did you not agree? Mm -hmm. You could go through and I itemize each of those points, oh, Julie. Okay. Right? Mm -hmm. And if you did that, would you not have a set of terms? Several. Mm -hmm. Right. Yeah, five, yeah. And then you mm -hmm. could write out what each one of them is? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Can you then see whether they are internally consistent with one another? Mm. Unity. Yeah. And ask the same question about this set. Mm -hmm. Are yeah. they? In un unity. Yeah. So now we can talk about her seeing, can we not? And her reflecting, can we not? Mm. Yeah. My seeing and my reflecting. Okay. All right. Okay. Third point. <laughs> What source could you use to corroborate it? Hmm. Okay. That's the third level of reflection on the dream. Huh. So hold that for a while. That's the last step. Uh, by the way, what source could we use to? Parmenides' hypotheses. What the? Parmen Parmenides' that, hypotheses. Is that one of Plato's dialogue? Yes. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. So then you check. Parmenides. Mm-hmm. To see how I, well I do. <laughs> uh-huh. What is she? Come on, what is she? <laughs> First of all, give me a grade. For myself? Yeah, doing this. Are these, first of all, are they consistent with one another? Are these consistent with another? Are there differences? So mm -hmm. you consider this as a, a paper someone is handing you, and you're the teacher, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. So you're now going to grade the paper. <laughs> I don't know. Um, let's see. 
Yes, it's like she's got her own metaphysics here. She's got her own no, model. No, normal. Still, yeah. No, normal. <laughs> yeah. Nice. Normal? Um, I don't... Yeah, I know several people like that, so it's normal. I am not normal. <laughs> or maybe I work with... Crazy. Weird people. <laughs> <laughs> alien, if you ask me. It's okay, alien. Okay, What would you say? Come on, stay with uh. us, Sean. What theme plays a major role in the thinking? Hmm. Finding the one. The logos. Thank you. Which one? Both? Oh. Okay. The one. Logos. And the logos. logos. Mm -hmm. Are they consistent? Come on. And the second part? Yes or no? Yeah, that's what I'm wondering. Consistent. But I'm trying to express it. That's if the is. source of all things that the logos can express, then would you expe expect it to be expressed? To be ex to be what? I'll help you. Contradictory, Express. inconsistent. No, if it's the source of all things the logos can express, it should be. Uh, well, she's already said it's, that the one is beyond logos, right? Mm -hmm. And yet, here. And yet, it's the source of all the things oh, of the logos. What? Did you hear that? Mm -hmm. I didn't say it. Did you hear what you're saying? Yeah. Uh, answer her. I'll, I'll listen. Actually, that's what she said. <laughs> okay. <coughs> yes, it's beyond logos, but yes, it's the source. She, 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 she. What's the source? The one or the logos? The lo the one. Yeah. Okay, now what are you forcing yourself to do right now? Reflect again. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you heard that one? Uh-huh. Yeah, that was clear. Conclude? That it, it can't be of it if it's not it. Mm. Yes, exactly. Okay. okay, try it. Shift now. Say, give me a grade for the seeing. For the seeing? Yeah. Hmm? Give myself a grade for the scene. Yeah. Got an F in the other one. <laughs> no, know. come on. Don't do that. Come on. <laughs> and well, I'm roll. trying to see if there's one and stuff. Pardon? That's good. We're seeing what holds them together. That's yeah. good. Yeah. Seeing what commonness they have. That's good. Yeah. Good. Um, what, what keeps them together. That's good. Right. What makes them not dissolve. That's yeah. good. How are um, you doing? Good. Thank you. What grade then? A. Thank you. So therefore, what is the dream presenting you with? Another koan? <laughs> a koan. A contrast between... Oh, my seeing. And your reflecting. My reflecting. Is that right? Yes. That is very strange. And does it raise some questions about my reflecting? How well you are understanding these two terms? Yeah. See, I went to bed with this question in my mind uh -huh. um, about the Parmenides hypothesis, mm -hmm. and I was trying to understand it. Yeah. And um, of course, now, this is why I had the dream. Mm. And um, I was trying to figure out uh, how can one be beyond everything 
And is it beyond even the Logos? And if it is, then where does Logos come from? By the way, if you find it curious that your dream does not include the idea of the one soul? I was trying to see if self was in it. What, what? I was trying to see if self was in it, uh, one or self, but I just Pardon went me. to the I one. I was trying to see when? In the dream? The very or? beginning. The, in, uh, seeing if there is one or self in them. Very top. Thank you. What was that like? Come on. That's the key sentence in the dream. Because that isn't seeing, that first one is a reflection. Or, or it would have to include both. What, read it yourself? Seeing if there is See, one. I'm determining. Or self in them. Right, between mm -hmm. two, three, four, and five. Mm -hmm. Seeing if there is one, one or, self. or self in them. Mm -hmm. What happened to that question? Looks like I let it go. Thank you. That's the issue in the dream. What does that mean? I let it go. It looks like I just went to the one instead of the instead of seeing trying to see if I could see both. Yeah, come on. Therefore, um, I want to know in the dream. Come on, state of mind. What was that like in the dream? I was determining whether two, three, four, and five. If there is one of self in them. Mm -hmm. It's almost like I feel like I felt like uh, once when I was talking about one, I was talking about self. Mm -hmm. Instead of saying one self, one self, one self, I was just saying one, 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 one. Let me ask you again. Mm -hmm. In terms of the dream, what were you experiencing? when that statement came clear to you in the dream. Oh, the statement of yeah, uh, seeing yeah. if there's one, like? one or self in them? That was what was interesting me before I went to bed, uh, mm -hmm. is why wa wanting to see the one in, in the self in two, three, four, and five. Um, and then uh, having that question in my mind of where it's at, where it's not at. Um, does do they both have one in self, or do they just have? Do some have one, some have then, self? Uh, I wonder whether you uh, answered my question. Hmm. Um, I'm sorry, <laughs> I was going on and on. Uh, what was it like for you to? What happened to you? What was the consequence? What was the effect? of having that first sentence occur to you It's like in I was dream. in wonderment again. <coughs> what, what? I was, I'm, I was in wonderment. Wonderment. More. Um, seeing the beauty and trying to understand it. What happened? Um, what happened to the state? Come on. Oh. Thank you, you got it. Yeah, I don't know what where it went. It? I don't know where it went. Um, I don't know where it went. It's like, um, I sure. feel like I, get, I got confused. Sure. That's right. Like in like my last stream. That's right. It's the like same I got thing. confused, I'm trying to go into the parking lot, I'm getting confused, and I, and I realize once I get confused, I'm like, oh no, I need to get out of here. No, here. Right. Yes, the wonderment. Right. Yes, the profound beauty. That's the state you were in. What happened to it in the dream? In the second, in this dream here. I don't know where it went. What happened to this state of wonder in the dream? Good question. Looks like I gave it up. Yeah. What happened to the wonder and the beauty and about the one and the self? What happened to it? Huh? Uh, it's more like instead of being in wonderment, I wanted to explain it to myself. Yeah, what's the difference? Then but, the wonderment's gone. You're just explaining it to yourself. You're trying to understand it and not be in the wonderment. Yeah. 
Okay. Um, you have yet to see the wonderment of the Logos and its relationship to the one. Ah, uh, yes, and I want to see that. Yes, I want to see that. So come on, go back. And the first sentence then, right? I had this question about the one and the soul. Mm. Major question, but mm. I let it go. Mm -hmm. Right? What was mm -hmm. it like holding on to it for as long as you could hold on to it? That state, that wonderment state yeah, is that's a... that's an interesting state. It's a very um, playful, yeah, um, open, playful. Uh, powerful... Powerful. Um, like you're going in, I want to even say like naked, like you're not bringing anything with you. Yeah. You're not yeah. bringing anything yeah. with you. You're not bringing anything. You're so just bringing whatever. we would whatever. like to know, come on, you see, we would like to know what happened then in the dream with the next sentence because he gave it up. After I gave right? up this, the, oh, the hypothesis phase. No, 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 no. Oh, okay. What then happened? it focuses on the one. Yes. Not the self. Right. right. Only the one is left, yeah. 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 Unity is not in one. And what's important in this is this third part, you see, because you went to bed thinking about these mm -hmm. from this work, from this work. Mm -hmm. So therefore you need to go back. Are you thinking of going back into it? Yes. <laughs> I know that. <laughs> um, yeah, because, um, yeah, I had some questions from the Friday night video um, yeah. that I watched. And it was just like I had all these questions on my well, mind. By the way, could I ask you a small <laughs> question? Would you look over that whole thing? Mm -hmm. What? So is there evidence of uh, the logos functioning on that whole thing? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what does that do? Shows me that I that uh, that I'm saying something, but yet contradicting myself. Mm. But now, what's it like seeing it? I'm happy that I'm seeing it. Sure. Because I don't want to be yeah. um, like yeah. led astray yeah. or going down the wrong parking right. lot. Right. <laughs> okay. Going down the wrong right. street. Thank you. Okay. Right. Mm. Thank you. Oh, good. Old. Thank you, Dream Master. My pleasure. <laughs> <laughs> well, because it, this is one that uh, pleasantly has homework. Mm. Right? Do it. Okay. I have a question. Um, what you see is that I was trying to determine what holds them together. What holds what? Uh, the hypotheses. Like, is there one that holds them together? Is there self that holds them together? What is it that holds them together? Thank you. No job. I went there a second page. Okay, take time out. Okay. Oh, it's like a good back noise. I If you like, Pierre said he's uh, into visiting tomorrow at 10, and I've offered my place. Oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
Okay, everybody, I presume you got a chance to read it. I have to read it out loud. They don't all have copies. Okay, please do so. I am going back to a job I had before. The buildings had changed. There was Mama. a lot. I was going back to a job I had before. The buildings had changed. There was lots of glass on the building walls. I was going to be on a new unit. There was a new supervisor. Her name was Walker. I was late about two hours. She looked at the clock. I saw she was concerned. Can you slower? Because we really oh, sure. to take notes. Oh, sure. Sure, no problem. Um, I was going back to a job I had before. The buildings had changed. There was lots of glass. I was going to be on a new unit. There was a new supervisor. Her name was Walker. I was late about two hours. She looked at the clock. I saw she was concerned about time. She was orderly, punctual. She wanted her unit a certain way. There was, uh, X was there. She was a psychologist. I was taking place I was taking the place of another psychologist who left. I went to get some of my personal things. I took my time. I had coins. I didn't have my own locker, so I organized my stuff so that no one could come in and steal stuff of mine. I came back to the unit. She was concerned about the time. Walker was. I ignored her concerns and asked what cases I had. She, sa she said, two, three, two, three, or four, six, and nine. And I asked about the probable cause hearings. She said they were coming up. I said, how many patients do I have? She said, 25. I ignored what she was concerned about. I said, I will do the probable cause and causes, and I won't do testing. I don't do much testing unless it was for the court. I took control and introduced myself as Dr. Yuliana, not Regina. I walked back to the unit and introduced myself to the staff as Dr. Yuliana. The patients were going to dinner and were all together, so I introduced myself to them as Dr. Yuliana. Okay, got that. I asked the staff what the dates of the probable cause were, I guess. They said Friday. So I looked at the other dates. I sat till 7. I went through the charts. I knew what to look for and where to look. The family, social worker. I knew the patient and I had a clear idea of why I wanted to keep the patient in the hospital. I went home 7 at 7 and I would be back in the, in the morning. I got there the next morning. I got there at 8 and the daily gatherings of the patient was at 8.15. So I again introduced myself, and I said I would like to meet my patients for my group and talk about a schedule. I knew that my organized and commanding role would let get back to Walker. Okay. Well. That's it. Okay. This is drama. Same What's questions. It? What's the issue? What does it turn about? Why is she having the dream? Yeah, good question. Why? All of these same questions. Sir? Who's the leader? Who's the leader on the unit? I can't hear you. Who is the leader? Like, she has a boss, and the boss yes. is the yes. one that's... Yes. She's not my boss, but she is the leader of the unit. Mm. Okay. Big difference. And what? Hold it. Well, in essence, I'm the, I'm the leader of my cases. 
she's the leader. She organizes the unit, not my cases. So it's more... Okay. Well, I, I see two parts when she came in late and two hours late and then that was, wasn't addressed and then, um, but I do like at the end of the dream where she kind of took control and asserted herself True. to the group. Continue that idea for the whole dream and what do you see? That, that portion of it in the beginning was ignored. It wasn't, it was, now there's this problem that's kind of following me, but it's ignored. Yes. Uh, what is the role of ignoring in that dream? Well, she ignores what this... Hold on. What? I ignore what the, I ignore what Walker's concerns are which is being on time. Okay, look here. One, how many things would you say in the dream are listed that you ignore? I think about three things. All right. Maybe, okay, we'll take a look. What does that mean? Um, and what does that do to this drama? Well, in some, in, in some way there's a conflict because she wants her role, she, she wants to control her unit and therefore control those who she doesn't control. That is that I am not, I'm not under her. Look, I see she, uh, she, she wants, wants to, to control. She wants to control everyone. And what are you doing in response to that? Um, well, I'm ignoring yeah, that control. Yeah, yeah. What do you think mm -hmm. of that as a strategy? Uh, well, it's not a good strategy. I should talk to her. Oh, and? Or tell her. Um, or address the fact that I'm, well, I'm not sure how to deal with it, but I I do know that the way I'm doing it is not the best. Okay. The way I, later on when I talk about, the, I try to get to her, to show her that I am in control, I try to demonstrate that, that I have a, I am in command of what I'm doing. But th that's nice, but what does that do in respect to I her? don't know how to deal with that. Okay. You find that moment in the dream she looked at her she, clock. She, look her. There's several events when you're ignored, ignoring. Right. Which one would you say is the strongest or most uh, important? Well, I think I was late two hours. She looked at the clock and I saw she was concerned about time. Okay. I that's guess one. I could I okay. could have addressed that right there. Yeah, that's right. Keep going. Um She was concerned about time. I ignored her concerns and asked what cases I had. So that's second, right? Same thing. Mm -hmm. Twice. Go ahead. Well, there's another one. I ignored what, let's see. Uh, I said how many, pa let's see. I asked about the probable cause hearing. She said they were coming up. I said how many patients do I have? She said 25. I was ign I ignored what she was concerned about. Yes, 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 yes. Like she wanted me to get on the patients yeah. now. And yeah. At that moment, what should you have said to her? Come on. Well, I At think that moment. Come on. I told her. I said I will do the probable cause hearings and won't do testing. It was like she was for, she was kind of pushing me to do testing. And I said, I won't do it. I just, oh no, I was letting her know what I was going to do. Like I was... Which is ignoring what her concern is. Well, her concern was primarily yeah, time. Yeah, yeah. No, I wasn't ignoring it that way. Okay. Point. 
What should you have said to her at that moment? Come on. I, sh I could have said, um, I understand you're concerned about time, but I am uh, alert to what I need to do for the patients and how to do it. And I will do it within the time frame that I have. Um, what would you say? I see she wants to control. If that's the issue, then right. how could you address that issue mm. directly? Directly? No. Yeah. Or openly or however you want to put it. Well, I think in the very beginning, I, I saw she was concerned about time. I mm -hmm. could have addressed it and said at that moment, Yes, I know that I'm late according to your time, but I am aware of what I need to do on the job. I know what my job is. Mm. I, 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 that's what I could have said. See, she has an idea of control. You have an idea of control. Right. What would it be like to address that issue while you were taking on the issue of time? I, to address her, to say that, oh, well, I don't know about bringing up the idea of control. What? Well, if that's what you're saying, if that's what you're saying. Well, I, I would, I guess, address that. I know you're, it looks like you're, con you're concerned about time. I recognize that I, I have an understanding of my, what I'm supposed to do and how long it's going to take. Okay. Basically, I don't. That, I didn't that, have that ignores her situation. Okay, I don't. Yeah. Right. The the thing is that she wants to control time. She so, wants to control how long I'm there, what I'm doing, and I'm saying no. I have a different role. I don't. Time is not. I can do that, she, and it doesn't matter what time I start or whether and what time I finish, Okay. just so it gets done. Yeah, yeah. you're challenging the way in which she uh, addresses time, but not the issue of the control. Okay, I don't understand what you're saying. Well, what you're saying is she wants to control what's going right. on. Yeah, she wants to control so her... So why not deal with that issue? Well, I don't know how. Well, I know, that's why I'm pushing it. I don't know, except, hey, you want to control me or something? I don't know. Yeah. Well, so come on, what, uh, what would it be like to, to uh, push that? Uh, to control. Uh, whatever way you'd go, what would it be like to do that? To control. Um, to deal with that. Uh, I don't know. Uh, she wants to. Um, There's also an element of controlling how, how I do work and how I think, too. It's like that's how she, de she thinks is what's ideal, is if she can control time and organize according to her standards, therefore... How are you going to deal with that directly is the issue. Um, well, I guess I could address her and say, look, I understand you have concerns about time, and you, you have a certain idea of organization, but I have to do my work, and the way I do my work is not based on a schedule that you have or anybody has. I see. I don't know. Yeah, okay. Uh, are you ignoring the issue of she wants to control? Are you dealing with that issue or oh. offering a defense of your what you want to do? Oh, I'm not addressing the... Con no. no. Would you agree that the defense of what you... Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Is that the same thing as dealing with the issue? Oh, she wants to control? No. Right. I am defending... What I'm doing. No, I don't know how to. I don't know what that would do. I don't know. If she wants to control... Oh, forget that. What kind of a person would deal with that issue? 
Mm. Or somebody who's commanding. A uh, commanding? More. They come. would address the lady and say... Commanding? Come on, what, is, what, what does that mean? Well, they they would know who they were and what they and what the person is doing and would they address would, it. They would know what they are doing. And what the person is doing. What kind of person is that? Can you characterize that kind of person? Uh, mm, <laughs> well, um, well, in the hospital, it would probably be the psychiatrist. No, not, <laughs> I don't know. not what kind of person. Come on. What kind of person is that? Uh, they're commanding, they would know what they are doing, and they'd know the other person. What kind of a person is that? See, what, what kind of person is that? Oh. What do you want to call them? Ship's captain, doctor, Sh lawyer. <laughs> but a person can be a ship captain and, and not and, do that. I don't know. In a variety of ways. You're not helping me. I'm not helping myself, that's why I don't know. Commanding, uh, they would know what they are doing and the other, and what the other person is doing. I don't know. It's a very powerful role, but I have no idea. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah. What's the difficulty in that kind of a role? For me? Uh, uh, just <laughs> anywhere. What's the difficulty? I just wonder. Who, uh, yeah. have, have you ever seen uh, movies? Sure. Uh, who would that person be? Who would that person be? Oh. Sherlock Holmes, maybe. Okay. I don't know. All right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like he know he knows he, he knows his seeing. He knows what he's doing. Okay. He knows how to proceed, and okay. he right. and he sees right. what right. other people are doing. He sees how other people are behaving in say, terms of uh, his investigation. Say, make up a story for me, okay? <laughs> I think this is one. Uh, Sherlock Holmes is invited to your dinner at home, and you're eight years old. What would happen? Eight years old. Um, I don't know if he'd come. Uh, he came. <laughs> he came. <laughs> Well, he'd sit at the table, and my mother would be pushing food on him. Now, what would he do? And he'd say, no, I don't want that much, or uh, I'll take this. And, uh, and your father? Oh, my dad. Um, No, I'm really not interested in talking about these subjects. Um, well, then how would he be received? He wouldn't be liked. What? If he said that, he wouldn't be liked. It would, he'd, a little bit or a lot of bit or half a bit? Well, he wouldn't be invited back. Mm -hmm. well, they, you have to tell me what that means. I'm, they'd I tolerate know. him for the dinner and then they'd be happy when he left. Oh, so then if you took on that role, what would happen at home? Uh, well, 
they'd be happy when I'm gone. Or mm. they wouldn't like it at all. Mm. Oh no, they wouldn't like that. Mm. So maybe it's better to avoid it then. Oh, yeah. Is that what you're doing in the dream? Yes. Oh. I am a dream. What does that mean? Mm. What does it mean? I'm no, sure. it's just, well, I, well, I have the dream. I mean, it sure is. I don't know where it goes, so I've been thinking about it. Um, um, what am I ignoring? Well, I guess I'm... An, uh, a, not addressing the issues that I see. Right. Wherever I because see them. Because if you were, the fear is you might be like one of these people. Or attacked. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. So what do you, do you think you're doing the right thing then? In the dream? In ignoring? Yeah. Um, at the time, yeah. What does that mean at the time? Well, at the time I thought it, that was the only thing I could do. But now that you look at it, what should you have done? Um, address the issue of her concerns oh. on all levels. And risk appearing? M more than a Sherlock. Um, probably, uh, well, it would be more, like a philosophical, come on, more, come on. more like a philosophical midwife. Ah, oh, oh, okay. Interesting. Yeah, that would be more powerful. Mm. And that's mm. what I refuse to do. <laughs> <laughs> or don't fear, don't feel I can do it in the proper way. Without, come on, without appearing. Well, without, with being un, in my presentation being unjust or unfair or not clear or not being just. Being, being just. Yeah, and therefore? I don't. Yeah. Time to change? <laughs> um, sounds like a good idea. <laughs> uh, a risky idea? Yeah, it mm. is risky. Mm. Time for... Uh... In many ways. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right, thanks. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs>
Koniec pan. Ok? 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 Can you read it first? I'm in my apartment and there's some shaking going on. At first I thought I was causing the shaking. Maybe I was drumming or something like that. But then the shaking gets stronger and stronger and I think, wait a minute, could this be an actual earthquake? Then it actually gets stronger and stronger and I notice the feeling of movement. So I think, so I think I'll go to the window to see if I can see anything outside. As I go to the window, it gets stronger and stronger. I look outside and it's really... The whole building is swaying a lot. Swaying a hell of a lot. My building is bending. I'm wondering where it's best to go or to hide when there's an earthquake. I'm thinking it's probably not good next to the window because the glass can break. So then I walk back away from the window and the swaying is getting stronger. But now I'm starting to experience it more personally, as if the earthquake is happening to my soul or myself. I realize that there's some shift going on. This is part of my growth. I, I start to realize that I'm having some kind of experience. Then I hear this voice or I have this thought that it's taking, it's taking me. It's taking me to a place that I need to look at. It's uncovering something for me. This is the natural process. And there's a thought of my sister that maybe, that maybe that's what I need to bring up and shine a light on. Like it's the next thing to fi for me to address. So then the experience gets more and more deep and soulful rather than physical. There's now a strong sense of pull and me being taken on this ride. And there's some kind of tension that's building along with it. Then all of a sudden it's like I arrive somewhere and there's an immense release and relief. Like the feeling of laying down on a bed after a very long day, but much, much stronger. It's like my soul went through something in order to reach this conclusion. This, ah. Uh, okay. What do you want to ask the gentleman? Chuck? This is, this is a good one. I, I don't have a question. I don't know. It, it's kind of hard to find a way in because the more he investigates it, the deeper it gets. And uh, with the exception of the line about investigating the sister, but that even leads to a deeper. So it's hard for me to find a way in. Okay. Well, Okay. I'm puzzled a little bit about the last line of the dream mm -hmm. here. Please. I'm puzzled a little bit about the last line of the dream where it says... Oh, yeah. Go ahead. Yeah. Well, it's, it's like my soul went through something in order to reach this conclusion. Yeah. And it's... <laughs> what conclusion? Thank you. <laughs> yeah, that's my question. Very good. Go ahead. Tell me. Uh, what does this conclusion refer to? It refers to the state of mind that I'm in. It's not, there isn't any, there isn't any words, any logos on it. Mm -hmm. It's, I'm, I'm using the word conclusion to describe that state, that, ah, uh, because it's, um, it has such a sense of, uh, having arrived. Okay. Um, but, but didn't you have a question about your sister? Mm -hmm. About? Your sister. sister. Yes, go ahead. Yeah. Uh, what do you want to know? Come on. <laughs> um, did, did this conclusion do anything for that uh, did that? Did this conclusion have anything to do with opening that up? Okay. 
He wants to know what kind of state of mind were you in in the dream when that voice announced what it did. Read it. There is a thought of my sister that maybe that's what I need to bring up and shine a what light on. What was that on. like? What, if, what effect did it have on you at that moment? It was very brief and... Grief? Brief. Yeah, and, yeah. I'm not familiar with that word. Talk about it. You know, brief. Something B. B for Bob. B? Yeah, brief. I like G. Okay. <laughs> well, actually, um, um, there's something there that's... That. That's like, uh, <laughs> like there's a lid on it or something. Um, um, okay. Something under the carpet. Okay. Um, yeah. What was it like? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. So what? <laughs> Talk about it. What do you mean, lid? Come on. I don't know, like... It's a lid over it. Yeah, what does that do? What, is, what effect does that have on you? Well, it doesn't... I, it doesn't... Um, I, I can't explore it. I can't look at it. Um, but... Hmm... Without, uh, without, I don't know. I do do I? But I can't look at it. Like, what does that do to you? Like, what effect does that have on you? If I can't look at it, it went by very quickly. It was like. Um, Like, I, I was on this um, kind of a tra trajectory. Yes, that's true. And um, it just kind of appeared, and, and then I, I noticed it, and then I kept going. Yeah, yeah. Uh, they're connected. Then I kept going? Yeah. Okay. So I kept going? So I, what's that like? What does that mean? Um, without, come on, without what? Well, I didn't... Mm, like, I, I, I've had this um, suspicion for a while that there are things about my sister that I need to reflect on and yeah, see. Yeah, and yeah, yeah. and um, when, this, when this came up, I, that, I was aware of that. Um, what does that do to you, though, see? Hmm. I mean, there's been a lid on it for a long time. You're going to lift off the lid, aren't you? I'd like to. Yeah, well, what's that going to do? I don't know. To her. To her? Yeah. Mm, I think it'll make me see her in a different way. Oh, 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 oh. Because there's... Oh. Oh, see. What does that mean? <coughs> well, there's a lot of questions about her and her role in my family. Yeah. And uh, you would be taking a little off of it. Yeah. What will that do for you and the family to take the lid off of it? Well, I mean, probably uh, cancel my membership. <laughs> <laughs> but, um... Uh, does the rest of the dream follow that state of mind? That this is earth, this is an earthquake. This is... 
opening this up is like an earthquake. <laughs> hmm. That's interesting. And the famine. Yeah. In, in me as well. And you. Yeah, you're in it. Yeah. So look, it's best to forget the dream. <laughs> you know, some dreams you forget about. Right. Oh, what do you think about that? It seems pretty important. Ooh. Could this be an interesting message for you? Yeah. How long have you decided to ignore it? The whole time. Yeah. But so it's a big event. There it is, the lid. You captured it well. It's interesting that mm -hmm. after that I had this big release. Yeah, you came to a conclusion. Yeah, but it wasn't in words. I don't mind. What do you think it was? Well, it was... I mean, I felt very free and open. Mm. So, it, so if you deal with this issue of your sister, will you be free? Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> I guess you'll have to see. Yeah. Yeah. Curious dream, isn't it? It is. Yeah. That was like the most subtle part about the dream. Yes. And... But it is an earthquake. At home. Yeah. The, it's it's um it's it's so central to yeah. everything in the family and the whole blooming family um, and and wherever else it goes So you felt good after this. You came to a conclusion. Yeah. I felt so good that I was scared of how good I felt. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, yeah. Not, not sure what to do with this. Well, don't ask me, it's your dream, I don't know. What do you think you ought to do? I mean, you did come to a conclusion now. Yeah. Yeah. I wish it had some words on it. Uh, it has words on it. It has words on it. Yeah, there are words. You have a voice. There's words. <coughs> It's a nice state of mind, isn't it? In the end, being free and I've never felt so open before. I've never had such an open experience before. Yeah, it's very powerful. Yeah. Even when I woke, woke up, I w still was in it yeah. for, for a little while. What was that like? Very broad. Broad. And um, open and... Open. But as... As soon as I woke up, it um, started started shrinking. Mm. Uh, sure. I just uh, got to do something about it, don't you? Is that right? <laughs> I guess. <laughs> <laughs> what 
was that move you wrote? I don't know. I mean, well, I know it's important. It's obviously pointing towards my sister that yeah. it's something that is important to look at. Yeah. Mm, but yeah. Mm. Other than that, it's. Um, Other than that. <laughs> 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 she just can't hold on. <laughs> so it's, it left you. With a question. Right, and that's very, very, very important. Right. Okay. It is. Yeah. Okay. Tomorrow's another day. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. All right. Tomorrow it shall be. Okay. Pleasure. Pleasure. Thank you. Good one. Yeah. Yes.